A progression is different than a continuum. It's extremely important for me to get our semantics right because if we can't communicate, can't be accountable, if we can't be accountable, we're not professionals. A continuum is the Google map that you just printed off from here to Chicago. It's gonna take us this long, these are our stops, I like this path, that's the route. The route to get a kettlebell swing or a push press, we're gonna show you that. As a matter of fact, we can show you that in five minutes. But what happens if things don't go well along the route? What happens when you get the detour, the bad weather, or the traffic jam? Sometimes you push forward, sometimes you hold, sometimes you backtrack. When real human beings are dropped onto a continuum for movement, you better be prepared not to push all the time. Sometimes you must hold. It will take some people quite a bit of time to get a really good deadlift. A deadlift they almost don't even have to think about. They bend over and pick it up and they do it with integrity. If you press, get on over to that swing because I think we can burn more calories with the swing and never plant that deadlift seed, you will always be overcoaching swings and you will never want Dan John to watch your client do swings because really it's not a testament of how good they are, it's a testament of how good a coach you are.